Welcome back to another video. I'm not sure if I should introduce this as a vlog or like, you know, my regular videos because I'm not sure what day I'm gonna use this for. Cause it's kinda, it's like a, this is a vlog. This is a vlog. So this video is going to be a content vlog or content video. I'm basically just gonna vlog myself doing some content, um, show you guys like certain equipment I use or like angles and different things that I do to just get the content that I get. I do surprising, let me not say surprisingly, but I do get asked a lot about the different things that I do or use or what I use to edit with or whatnot. So I'm gonna make a little video about all of that. So right now I just got ready, well not just got ready, I got ready a few hours ago, but I was trying to get my video up for today. And now that I'm ready to leave and go, it looks like it's about to pour outside, so I don't know. So I needed to get these photos for a styling page. So I have the outfit here, I'm about to put it on that I was styled to wear. Is that how you say it? When you're styled by someone? I got styled. <laughs> Anyways, I'm about to put it on, but these pants, I gotta give them like a little, um, steam and why is my steamer not turning on okay there's a little steam <laughs> i'm being real ghetto okay because i already have it plugged up here and i have my camera set up here i usually use my rack that i put my clothes on for my clothing hauls to steam clothes but since i'm right here we're gonna do a real ghetto with the microwave Please, Laura, hold the rain. I don't want my outfit, my makeup, really, to go to waste. Not my outfit. I'm not going anywhere, but. Am I doing this right? pretty good uh, my only thing is I really think it's about to rain um, let's try let's try if we if it starts raining before I get out the door then it just wasn't meant for me to do this right now but if I can beat the rain and get the photos we're good I just feel like oh this is why why Maybe I should have checked the weather today. But okay, y'all, let's get into this content vlog. Just a fun little vlog. Like I said, I can share some of my things that I do to get my content with y'all. Who knows, I may give you something that you never knew to do or thought to do. And yeah, and of course, if you have any tips based off what you see me do and you're like, Lala, you should do this instead, feel free to nicely comment down below and let me know. So, okay, I'm gonna put this on and Let's see. Okay, so the outfit is on. Um, I'm hiding my boobs since I'm going downstairs. I think if the top would have came like here and was a little longer, it'll look nice with the pants, but the way that it does this, I don't like it together. But we're gonna make it work. When we get all the shoes on and everything and I start taking the pictures, we it's gonna make sense. Okay, so I have my tote mcm tote with my shoes oh i'm missing a pair i have two shoes so i'm changing the shoes twice first my little black bottegas and then these gold jean vito rossi and i got like you know i got like a comb and blotting stuff and let me put my lipstick 
and then also the bag that she wants me to wear with this is in here it looks like the sun is trying to come out all right we're ready let's go is my video still processing yes of course so okay we are out the door let's go oh wow why am i forgetting the most important thing my tripod for <sighs> for the photos child so i came to gulfstream park and this is like the only area i can see where it's like very chill nobody's really over here so i'm gonna take the pictures here Okay, y'all, so at the time of me taking those photos, I did not get to go in too much depth about the app that I'm using to take the photos. So I wanted to touch on it a bit. So the app that I use is called Lens Buddy. Basically, it's a way to take photos hands-free without using a clicker. I mainly use this app for Instagram photos or like clothing haul photos for my thumbnails. So basically, you just set up your phone on your tripod or whatever you're gonna use to hold your phone to take the pictures for you. You can set the number of photos you want it to take. I usually just keep it on until stopped. So it'll take photos until I physically press stop after I'm done posing. Or you can set it to a certain amount of photos that you would like for it to take and it'll stop once it reaches that amount. Once you take the photos, you are able to go in and like them or dislike them, of course, save and delete. But what I do is I'll go through them and I'll like the ones that I think are cute and dislike or just not even touch the ones that I don't like. So once you like them, they get put in a folder. Ratings and then you go to like and it'll separate all the pictures that you sat there and you actually liked which makes it easier to narrow down and see which ones you really like and you can import them and save them to your phone. And that's why you see that little yellow thing there because I decided that I like this picture better than the other ones and I saved it to my phone to use for my thumbnail. And of course it has flash, it has like the grid of how big you need, like if you need the square fit or if you need the 16, 19, there's other settings. And real quick, I have my timer on three seconds, so it gives me three seconds, oh, five, excuse me, to get in position. And then it just starts taking the photos. And I also believe that there's five seconds in between each photo. So that's how you use it. Also, my apologies, I did not realize how out of frame my camera was. So, I gotta show y'all what I got, and this is what I got. Me just walking back and forth, trying to get some good photos. Okay, y'all, so I give a, I don't like this location. In the mornings, that's what I think I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna probably look one more time today to see if I can find somewhere and try um, to get some more picks and the other shoes that I need to switch to. I wanted to do everything early today, but um, trying to get my video published, that took up some time. So, and plus I was an hour behind because I didn't know the time was changing today. So I got up thinking it was going on 7 a.m. and it was already going on 8, so yeah. But the spot that I really wanna go to because she sent me like two spots that she thought would make good backgrounds for the outfit, but I don't wanna drive that far. It's like way out, so. I thought of this spot that's by my house. I'm like, that looks like this, but it's so full right now. Like I drove over there, it's like packed. And I know in the mornings it's closed. Like that whole little area is closed. So I'm gonna go back, but this happens sometimes. Like I'll go out and take pics and then it doesn't work out all the time. So this is real life. Oh, she's texting me. Let me see what, she's, what she thinks. 
Hey y'all, so it's been a few days. Today I am filming a clothing haul. So when I do these, I usually just record the haul here on my camera and I have my phone on standby and I'll have my tripod so I can take pictures in the outfits for the thumbnail. So I need to vlog this on my phone since the camera's up, so I should have just opened this on my phone. Okay, y'all, we are on the phone now. I just turned my little things that I have on my table around so they can be seen in my background on the camera i gotta move coco's cage a little bit so it's not in the way so yeah just make sure like the background is kind of pleasing i'm gonna actually turn those lights on up there so it's cuter and put my fireplace on i left my taller tripod in a car this one does get pretty tall but it gets about to this height and i think i might need it taller so i have it on top of this like shelf thingy and then I have my camera here with my ring light behind it. Hey y'all. And I got my mic hooked up. Since I'm like trying on clothes and I'm far away, the mic helps, you know, smooth my voice more. Um, of course, if you, Coco, having a phone or a, a camera, it's only, it's really, to me, it's up to you. Let me come right here. It's up to you how you want your audio to be because there's some people I know like they're using phones and stuff and like the audio doesn't really bother me. I have had experiences where I couldn't hear certain people like vlogging on phones, but like if you know what you're doing and you know like you can get good audio with your phone, so be it. Same thing with the camera. I didn't really need an external mic but for videos like this, I do. And I definitely hear the difference when I watch my videos back and I watch one that's like, that I did without a mic or one that I did with the mic and I can see the difference. So I definitely recommend a mic. And since I'm trying on clothes, I'm facing this way. <laughs> this is what I got on right now, y'all. My cycle started today. I'm cramping. I'm a little tiny bit bloated. Not so much thanks to my my mushroom coffee, but I like to do it this way because the windows, I'm trying not to show too much outside, but um, I like the natural light, but I still got my ring light on. And then I'm gonna hang up my clothes, but I did wanna show um, my big cute bag. I know brands like when you show the bag. So I'm like, I wanna show the bag and then I'll throw the outfits up here really quick before I start getting dressed. today okay so i joined lemon eight lemon eight reminds me of tiktok but like for us <laughs> it's not like let me show you a tiktok hack and all this crazy stuff that is on tiktok it doesn't have 
I don't think it has direct message. It's like a lot of features missing that Instagram or TikTok or even Snapchat have. And I like it for that reason. It's strictly about whatever content you're posting and you don't have to niche. Like you, of course you can. And I feel like the lifestyle, beauty, everybody does like beauty lifestyle. What's the other one? Whatever it say in my bio, my description, that lifestyle beauty there's another one i can't think of it i feel like i love to say that because that leaves so much room for all the type of content that i like to create i don't want to just be a makeup artist i don't want to just be an amazon influencer i don't want to just be a lifestyle person i mean <laughs> i want to do everything that i like so i bought some stuff on amazon to make my coffee look prettier. Let me get this box. This is my tripod sometimes. So I got some stuff to make it look prettier. Um, you guys will probably see this footage twice because I'm making two videos with this <laughs> content. So let me show y'all the setup. I have my tripod here. I like to use this side for my phone because the I just noticed that the quality is so much better with the back cameras versus the front. So, so I don't edit on the app like Instagram, TikTok, all that. I, I mean, I barely even go on TikTok anyway. I just record and then I edit the same way I edit my YouTube videos. And then again, I don't want to be in it. Is my face in it? Yeah. So let's pull it down, I guess. See. Okay. I hope I'm getting it. That's why, if y'all see me looking, don't think I'm weird. I'm trying to see this. sets of content so this is a video itself about the ice tray from Amazon and then I'm gonna use the ice in the coffee video and then I'm also doing the, the coffee video is about the coffee brand itself and then another with the Amazon products that I use to make the coffee so this is three sets of content that I'm working on or starting
Coco, you're in the frame. Coco. <laughs> it's so adorable, I know you're gonna be next to me, but I need you to go right here. See? Good boy. You're still in it. <laughs> hey everyone, and welcome back. Oh my mic. Dang it! I just cannot. That's how it be, y'all. Lord have mercy on me. I got my notes for my video here on my iPad. If you're new here, my name is Lala. Hi, welcome, welcome to my channel. And if you're returning, then what's up? How you doing? So right here is where. I will insert the footage and then my voiceover will say, okay, then it's gonna come back. Detail, pricing, and colors, what's next, okay. Now I need my phone. <laughs> so, you gotta go. Oh, I gotta close the door. Come on. Who are we? The door was like too bright on one side and I need to take my thumbnail pictures now that I'm done recording the video. Sometimes I'll do it before, sometimes I do it after, like today I'm doing it after. So this little thing that holds my camera, I believe it is called a, I don't know what it is. Um, it's like a tripod, but it's a remote. I think it's called a remote. But anyways, it's connected by, I believe it's Bluetooth technology, yeah. And you can use it as like a clicker for the camera. So that's what I do when I take my thumbnail pictures on my camera. But when I take them from my phone, I use LensBuddy, the app that I showed y'all in the beginning. y'all see just so you guys can see i'm gonna click it and then the timer goes off Hey y'all, so it's the last day of this vlog. I am now editing my video that's supposed to go up today, <laughs> but I started editing it late because I knew it's not so, so much for me to edit and I can get it done at a decent time today. And then also yesterday I was pretty busy, so I didn't take the time to stop and edit the video, but I'm gonna do it. Well, I already started editing it now and I'm to the point where I'm showing how my luggage looks right before this y'all saw me like recording what it looks like and i didn't like how it looked i'd rather the camera be sitting still than me maneuvering it because it shakes i don't know how to make my camera not shake i need to to learn that but anyway i was on the phone and i ended up having to use my other phone on this tripod to get me you know i just wasn't able to clearly think about how i wanted to do it so I mean, now I'm going to do it. <laughs> Okay, y'all, so like I said, I'm editing the video and I've already started. The app that I prefer to use to edit my videos is called InShot. I feel like InShot just gets the job done and it's easy to use. When you're not done editing a video, you can draft them so you can always go back. This is my, the video y'all watching now, 
this is the beginning part but you can edit videos photos sometimes i have to do certain things on here that i can't do on canva for my thumbnails so that is convenient and then collages i don't really do so but today's video is about my remote luggage so as you can see you have all these features to that you're going to need to edit your videos you can insert videos on top of the video like this is considered a video so it's like picture in picture you can move it around and you can undo stuff so i just undid that and put it back where it was review on my remote original cabin luggage so i've had it for two years now i already did a review on it previous you can insert text you can do everything music so what i've started doing is screen recording music from youtube that is non-copyright and you can import it here and then once you import it you can name it i just extract the audio from the screen recording and then i save the songs they also give you a variety of songs to choose from on the app um, as long as you put in the credits in your description i don't think you'll get copyrighted but i don't even if it's for like more than a few seconds i don't even use their music then this is what we just recorded i edited it edited it I edited it separately, so all I had to do was what just it looks like now. insert it in, and yeah. And now I can just skip that part since I edited it already and just get back to editing the rest of this video. I have about 18 minutes left to edit. It should take me about an hour to finish, maybe more who knows it's 10 o'clock now i want to finish at least by 11 11 30. opinions this is from the original collection so they have a few different ones the